Hello. Have you ever been thinking about something so much you just couldn't turn off your brain when you're trying to go to bed? Have you ever had times when you're worried about something so much you just couldn't get to sleep? Today we're going to talk about visualization. This is your mental health moment brought to you by Illinois Extension. My name is Chelsea Byers and I serve as a family life educator in Champaign Ford, Iroquois, and Vermillion counties. Today we're going to talk about the benefits of visualization and try a visualization activity. First, did you know that visualization can help you take a personal time out during the day? Maybe it's because you're in pain and you're trying to work through that pain. Maybe you're going through a lot of stress and are trying to decompress a little. Maybe it's because you can't turn off your brain at night. There are many reasons to use visualization. Some athletes and professionals use visualization to see themselves succeed or to achieve their goals to improve the performance or build their confidence. You too can use visualization to build your confidence or succeed in your goals. You can visualize, visualize yourself succeeding. Let's try a visualization activity. But first, I want you to get in a comfortable position. Put both feet on the floor. Take a deep breath. If you prefer, feel free to lie down or just get comfortable in your chair. Take a couple big deep breaths to reset. Find your natural breathing pattern. Close your eyes if you're comfortable. If not, find a soft gaze. Remember, there's no right or wrong. Just bring your attention to how you feel in the situation. Are you ready? Let's begin. What I'd like you to do is find your happy place. Think of a place where you feel comfortable, a place safe, secure, a place that brings you joy. Look around. Are you inside or are you outside? Are you in a backyard or by the ocean? Are you looking out towards the mountains? Take a deep breath in. What do you smell? What can you feel? Are you sitting on something? Are you sitting on a bench, a log, in a comfortable chair? Is there anybody there with you? Do you see a box sitting there? It's there right near you. Pick it up. Take all your worries that you have place them inside of that box. Shut the box and put it back down. You do not need to think about any of your worries for now. Take a deep breath in and blow it out. Enjoy the secure feeling of being in this happy place. Focus on all the things around you you can see, what you can smell, what you can feel, what you can hear. Take a deep breath in and breathe it out. Take a moment, look around your happy place. One more time. Come to this place whenever you are in need for a break, a place where you can set your worries aside for the moment. Now slowly come back from your happy place. Feel free to stretch, slowly open your eyes, and come back to us. What did you notice during this practice? What were you thinking or feeling during this activity? Oftentimes, people feel a sense of peace. Some people have a hard time getting into this activity. It just depends on the person. If you found this difficult, I encourage you to try it again. It's always one of those things to try more than once before you dismiss it. Now, when trying visualization, 
it is a good activity to help you with relaxing your body and giving your mind a moment of peace. It's a good way to help you manage stress and manage pain. No matter the reason for utilizing visualization, it gives you control over your present situation. It might not change your current situation, but it could help you lead to a good night's sleep, especially if you're a person who likes to think about things right before you go to bed. Think about trying to use visualization in those moments when you just need a break from the stress that's on your mind. This was your mental health moment. For more information on visualization or other activities like this, visit go.illinois.edu slash manage stress.